Hey there, everybody. I have something very special to share with you today. Can you tell what it is? Can you? It's my old camera collection. So, let's start with this one. The Square Shooter 2. Look at this. In just wonderful condition. Just beautiful. Oh, it's a little red square in there. Great condition. All my cameras I purchased off of eBay. And I'm very particular about purchasing old things. I don't want my stuff to look like crap. I'm not big on rust or nastiness or things that look like foods on it. That's just nasty. But um, so all my cameras are in really good collection, good, <laughs> good condition. Um, this is an Argus 75. This is a medium format camera. And uh, a lot of people, maybe about two, three years ago, were really into doing the shooting through the camera and um, using their modern camera and getting the pictures that looked all crappy, dusty and everything. Doing a whole lot of that. And uh, I never really got into it because it was just oversaturated and everyone doing it. But I love the camera that you can do it with. Um, another favorite of mine. This is a favorite. Right here is the Polaroid. Good old Polaroid land camera. The thing that's unique about mine is that I've got the flash. A lot of people, when they get the camera, this is all that they've got. So if they're buying old school cameras, this is pretty much all that they're getting. But um, I did a lot of searching and I was not going to settle for this particular camera unless I had the flash to go with it. So uh, great find right there. Um, another one that I have, and what's great about this one, this is a star meter. That one out the way. This is a star meter outfit. Look at this bad boy. So you've got the camera here. And look back there, we still, there's a ton of flash bulbs in there. I can't use the camera, but I've got perfectly in perfect pristine condition flash bulbs that I can use with this camera. And some film that expired, or rather, it needed to be processed uh, before August 1964. Missed that by a few years. But uh, what I like about this is that it came in, it's in pristine condition. It's probably my best, almost mint condition camera that I have. Um, another one, I actually have a movie camera. And again, another brownie. And this one also came with film. Uh, no lie. Daylight, chrome color, Kodachrome <laughs> 2 daylight film sealed in the box this one really should have been processed by january 1968 again missed it by a few years but uh it's a functioning camera movie camera isn't that awesome all the little dials here tells you what to do with it what you need to do this i'm just just fast blows my mind somebody really took great care of the camera like that another one i have which is um beautiful camera here I was surprised to see this one first one I've gotten that's coming to case. And it's, oh, isn't that pretty? Look at that. Signet 40. Kodak camera again. Kodak made a lot of cameras. Something else that came with this camera is an actual daylight filter. Again, blows my mind some of these little things that are here with the camera. <laughs> I love it. Oh boy, I love it. Some of these things that are just here with the camera that um, you just can't find anymore. So I'm always just so happy when I find people who take care of stuff and you know I can get it. And one more to show you too. Another kids type camera here, another little brownie. And this one here is a starlet. It's a teeny camera. And cameras like this, kids would have used back in the day. So that's why they're so small and to worry about it and they're really really light now here's one do any of you remember this the captiva oh yes bam look at that bad boy ah! a captiva slr remember this camera i know i'm not the only one who had this autofocus 
Polaroid thought they really did something when they brought this bad boy back. And you know, you would do your picture and everything, and then the picture would come back here and slash. And you could watch it develop. <sighs> and it still works. I just have no film. But uh, here's my old camera collection, and I hope you have enjoyed looking at it. Do you collect anything? Do you collect old cameras? I know I'm not the only one. Share your collections with me. I'd like to see what you have, especially if you have old cameras. I, I just love them. So share that with me. All right? I'll see you tomorrow.